Hey everyone, welcome to LS Live. We're here, it's four o'clock on Wednesday, which means we are live on the wholesale account. This is the account dedicated to all things Libby Story brand. If you weren't, like, if you didn't know, we have a whole brand. It's called Libby Story. We carry it in our store, other stores carry it. If you are a store owner yourself and you want to, like, if you're interested in carrying Libby Story brand, thanks for tuning in. If you're just someone who is interested in Libby Story as a whole and just is interested to see what we have up our sleeve as far as brands go, as far as our brand goes, thank you so much for tuning in. If you are someone who's interested in carrying our brand, be sure to check out our website, LibbyStory.com, and then you can head to shop and then scroll down on shop. There's a wholesale tab. You can see everything we have that is up for the fall collection, for the holiday collection. We should have spring up pretty soon if it's not up already. You can see a little bit of spring, summer from last year if you're just kind of interested in what we do in the spring and summer. There's a whole jewelry line, all that good stuff. And we're so excited to share it with you. And today I have a few just like little things that we have in our store from our fall collection. First of which I'm wearing this top and then I have a bunch of jewelry on and then I have this dress back here um, in a couple different colors that I'm going to show you. It's very very similar to the top that I showed last week. If you're interested in seeing that top, check back at last week's live feed. There's all sorts of good information about that. But today I'm gonna go ahead and get started on this. Um, and as always, we go live here every single Wednesday at four and then we have a, an Instagram page too that's called The Libby Story. If you head over there at 4.30, we'll go live as well. Um, I'm actually going to have the same stuff on that one as the other one, but if Instagram's more your jam and you would rather see the live stuff on Insta, um, head over there and also you can just follow it and we post pictures from our lookbooks um, of upcoming pieces, things that we've just gotten in, samples that we've just gotten in. If you just want previews of what's to come, if you want to see how we styled some of our favorite pieces from our collections, head over to that Instagram account because it's full of goodness. All right. Now I can get started on this top. It's just like this really, really fun gray top. It's very loose, very flowy, very breezy. It's a great top for the transition into the fall because here I know it's so hot for so long, but you wanna go ahead and start wearing fall stuff, especially when it starts hitting September, even early October, it's pretty warm. And this one is just a great like loose light top. It has a bell sleeve. It's got this tie detail that goes all down the side. It's like ties right there and it kind of scrunches. You can tell it's tied throughout the arm up to the elbow. And then it not only has that detail on the side, but it has this neckline that cinches right here, like right in my middle chest. And then it actually opens right here. And it kind of opens a little bit. You see a little bit of skin, but not too much, especially if you're moving around, you might see a little peak, but then it kind of crosses over right here and there's a seam. So that way it almost looks like a wrap top, but it's not necessarily a wrap top. It just has that kind of look to it. It is it's higher in the front than it is the back, so it's hitting me about my um, belt line right here in the front, but the back, it is down a little bit past my, my rear end, so it is a high-low, which I think is a fun uh, silhouette for things, especially now that like belts are a really big thing. I didn't put on a belt, but if you had a belt with like a big fun buckle or something, you could have that show because the top is a little bit higher. These jeans are like a mid-rise, so it hits me about the belt line in a mid-rise pent level. And then in addition to this top, I have on a few pieces of Libby Story brand jewelry. Um, all the pieces of jewelry we carry in our store are from our brand and then most of them, if not all of them, should be on our wholesale website. So definitely click through those. I love our jewelry. I'm wearing a couple rings to start off. I have this kind of like bar ring and I love this ring because it's one piece of jewelry that it looks like a few and it's just, it's, a, it's very bold. It has these little, um, they almost look like studs. They look like little to me, honestly, they look like little Mayan temples or something, or like little pyramids. <laughs> I don't know, because it looks like stones. But they're studs, it's really cool. I like I like gold jewelry. And then this one's a really fun, just like crystal that has the gold wrapped around it. The crystal is kind of sharpened at one end, like it's cut on one end, and the other end it's like rough, like almost like it was just broken off a bigger piece has pretty wide band. The band is adjustable on this one, so if you have bigger or smaller fingers, you can just adjust it as you need it. So if it's fine. This one is not adjustable, but I mean, if it's my fingers perfectly, and I, I like to think I'm pretty average. And then last but not least, as far as jewelry goes on me, I have this very cool kind of like 
not a choker per se, but it's like this very structured necklace with all these little doodads hanging off of it. I'm actually going to take it off so you can see how it works. It has these little buttons, and what you do is you just kind of open it. It has a, a little bit of give to it, and you just slide it right on. It's got this one little kind of greenish uh, bead. It's greenish stone. It has a longer kind of white opaque stone. It's got a half moon, which I think is fun, and then it goes back to that green stone in an arrow. I like all these geometric shapes. I think it adds just like a little bit of, um, I don't know, I don't know what it adds to it. I, I just like the geometric shapes. I like this necklace a lot. It's like kind of unexpected. I don't see a whole lot of jewelry that's structured like this, but we have a good amount of um, necklaces that have this kind of look about them, and they're all really cool, and they all have different kinds of stones hanging off them. I picked this green because I happen to be wearing like green shoes. They're not Livy Story brand, but I thought it added a little bit of fun color to this look since the top is gray and white. I wanted it to have a little bit of unexpected color in there. So that's the top I'm wearing. And now I can show you all the dresses that are over here. It's the same dress, but two different colors. And it's this, it's a very similar dress to the top I showed last week. So if you're, again, if you're interested in that top, head over to last week's live cast and you'll be able to find it no problem. Also, if you'll ever miss a live feed or something, or you wanna look back to the Instagram one since those don't save more than 24 hours, we have a YouTube channel. It's just called Libby's Story. If you head over there, any live we've ever done, whether it's on this account, the Instagram account, our Libby Story Ridgeland account, every live feed is there. So if you just wanna like sift through and see what you can find, those are there. And then we of course keep the ones on our Facebook forever. Um, and we try to do the same thing on these Libby Story wholesale ones. So if you miss Instagram, you can head over to Facebook and pretty much see the same thing. Alrighty. I'm gonna start with the gray one. And like I said, very similar to the one I showed y'all last week. Um, it has these metallic gold kind of stripes. They look like very painted on. They look very like like rough and tumble like it was um, not DIY because obviously we didn't do it ourselves but I don't know it just adds a little bit of edge to it. A little bit of like roughness about it so it's not just like girly gold. It has a slight v-neck. It's not super v but it is like a mid v-neck. has a front pocket. A frocket if you will. And it's like a loose frocket so it kind of like hangs there a little bit. And then what I love most about this is the open back. It has this kind of keyhole back. So if you did want to pair it with some kind of um, fun bralette, which we have a few bralettes that would have looked really, really cool under this, you can stick one under there and be able to see it. Or you could do no bralette and just have this be a little sexy skin showing. It has the gold, again, on any seam, like on any edge, it has this gold detailing on it. And then it has it on the bottom as well, you can see that. And this dress, another cool thing about it is the way it's dyed. It's dyed so that way every time you wash it or anything like that, the, um, the dye itself is going to kind of bleed out of it. So you're going to want to wash these by themselves. But also don't be alarmed if it starts to look more distressed, more worn. It's meant to do that as you wear it. So that way they all become like really one of a kind pieces that you have in your closet because everyone is going to wash out a little bit differently. So like I said, don't be alarmed if it starts to wash out. Um, just know that if you do wash it, keep it separate from your other things because you'll get dye on it. There's even like a sign on here. It has like a little um, note. So if you do get this one, you know that it has a warning on there so you don't forget. It says this item is garment dyed and designed to fade and create the well-worn look of vintage pieces. Color loss will occur in the first washes and is natural characteristic of the dyeing process. Simple as that. It's super cute. So we have this gray color and we have this berry color. Same details, has the same gold trim, same opening in the back, same front pocket, same length and everything. It's actually a little bit of a longer dress. It's not gonna hit you. On me, I'm like 5'3". It's gonna hit me at the knee. So if you're a little bit shorter, it's gonna hit you at the knee. If you're taller, it might hit you a little bit above the knee. So if you're looking for a dress that's a little bit longer, that's not gonna be like short, short, you know, this is a great, great option. But yeah, I love this little uh, berry color. And also that shirt I showed y'all last week came in berry and the gray. That one I think was a little bit more tie-dyed. This one's a little bit more even. But like I said, that washing and dyeing process is going to make this a little bit less even. It's going to make it look more worn as you wear it. 
All right, guys, that's all I have for you today. I hope you all enjoyed those tops and dresses. As always, we are here every single Wednesday at 4, and then we have our wholesale Instagram account just called The Libby Story. If you head over there at 430, we'll be with you there every single Wednesday, including in just a few minutes. If there's anything that you all want to see, if there's anything that you're interested in, whether it's uh, samples from upcoming seasons, if it's pieces from this season, if it's like styling them different ways, whatever. If y'all want to see it, we'll do it. So leave a comment, send us a DM. If y'all have any suggestions, if y'all have any questions about anything, like how to sign up to become a part of our Libby Story fam and have our clothing in your store. Um, and you can always visit LibbyStory.com and go to wholesale under the shop list. And you can see everything we have to offer as far as our wholesale line goes. Thank you all so much for joining us. We will see you all next week and in a few minutes on Instagram. Bye.